god. Oh my god. Hello honey buns, it is Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you're just joining us now, welcome! So today's video, as you can see, I'm with Dad. This is Dad. Now, you're probably thinking, why are you in the car, which looks like the middle of the night, what are you doing? Well, you're probably not thinking that because you can see the title of the video. Anyway, me and Dad are booked in tonight to stay in the worst rated hotel in Newcastle. Sean was meant to take this duty. Sean was meant to be the person to come with us, but he chickened out. He's got work the next day, so he couldn't come. So I had to drag Dad along because I don't want to be killed. So I needed some support. How I've, do you I've feel? I've got work the next day. Yeah, I know, but still. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel about us dragging you along? It's all right. Yeah. I'd rather know you would know that you were here. Yeah. So we have just pulled up outside the hotel. Um, we are basically just going to go through some of the reviews. Now, I've kept the reviews from Dad. So Dad has not seen the reviews. He literally does not know what he's let himself in for yet. So I'm going to read some of the reviews on my phone now. Now, this is off TripAdvisor. Like always, I'm not going to mention the name of the hotel. I personally don't feel it's necessary. I'm going to get in and I'm going to read you some of the reviews from the hotel that people have reviewed and these are all very recent reviews as well so these aren't like past reviews years ago these are literally like a week ago a month ago so these are really really new reviews so I'm going to read them me and dad yeah I'm not looking forward to this if you like this video please give it a thumbs up it helps out a great deal the things I do for YouTube okay don't go in turn around find somewhere else Dusty carpet not sure what color they once were self-cleaning loose shed with hen and stag parties oh my god ladder in the bunk bed held on by sticky tape <laughs> and paper thin walls maybe it was a horror movie set i half expected an axe through the door with someone shouting he has johnny <laughs> Oh my God. Can I also just say, yes, I forgot to mention, this hotel does have shared toilets and shared showers, so you don't have your own personal toilet and shower, which to me is just like... No, no. I've never known that before, have you? Yeah, I've been in bed and breakfast. Oh, have you? And yeah. that's the case. I've personally never stayed in anything like that before. Um, Okay, the cheap, cheap and cheerful jailbreak. Visited Newcastle upon Tyne on business and the room was dirty. I smell, I smell like a jail and smells like a jail cell. Small old TV, but had Wi-Fi. Horrible mark, chipboard, bed, base and stained dirty room. Bed was comfy though, cheap though, external shower and plastic tiny loo. Weird. <laughs> oh my God, one word describes this, don't. Unless you're used to prison accommodation, even then I'm sure a jail is cleaner than this. The prices on here, I paid £20 for this room for two people for one night. So I mean, if that doesn't bloody show you what this is going to be like, then I don't know what will because £20 is incredibly cheap. Like I don't even, you don't get that in hotels, do no. you? They're never that price. And reviews just go on and on and they're all bad. This, this hotel is literally rated one and a half star, so it is bad. Like literally, they're all bad. I've seen pictures of bugs in the bed. I've seen pictures of people getting up in the morning with rashes from bugs from the bed. I've seen just horrific pictures of this hotel and I'm really not looking forward to it, but I'm also a bit nervous case would die. We're not going to die. Well, you never know. Well, the reviews fucking say the might. We'll just jam the chair against the door. <laughs> <laughs> Jump out the window. Anyway, so that is a bit of the reviews. You can kind of picture in your own head what it's going to be like. We're going to go in now. We're going to check in. And yeah, that's... We'll be in the room within the next 10 minutes. <laughs> Come on then. Anyway. By the way, I forgot to tell you, one of my friends here on YouTube is actually doing the same video, but in her area. You probably have already heard about, but Holly Vlogs is going to the worst rated hotel in Norwich, which is where she's from. So I'm going to leave Holly's video below as well so that you can go and check it out. Um, because yeah, I know it'll be really good. And these videos are such a trend at the minute. And I love seeing them. So yeah, that Holly's video will be linked below. Definitely go and check it out. Hi, I'm just going to go for the one night. Is that any? Not really. Are you going to smoke? No, no smoke. Um, what number did you say we were? 113, where's that? Oh, yeah. What's the light then? Lift to go there? Well. 
like where the flush is. Remember, remember, more public thing. Please, 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 please. What do you think? Oh, it must be fun. Do you want to stay double locked, man? Okay, so we've just walked into the hotel room. First impressions, Dad read a sign on the counter. What did it say? Something like, please note this is a budget hotel. No, but about the toilets. Oh, the toilets after use, like the bottom of the corridor and after use the self cleaner solution. <laughs> so they don't even get proper cleaned. I'm being a bit quiet because we are quite near to the reception. So basically, we've just walked in the room and I just want to show you the door like it actually looks. Like, can you say it's all broken and chacked in the carpet? Yeah, and the carpet going up there, all this clad and like literally look dust worthy. Don't forget, tell them about what the man can put. Oh, yeah, tell him. Give away the remote control for the tent. Yeah, there was not, wasn't even in the room, the remote was given away. So, this is basically the room. So, this is the bunk bed. Girl hairs. Are you joking? No, girl hairs and hanger. Let's have a look. Must be where they hang the wig. Oh, oh my <laughs> god, there's actual hair. Let me see if I can get the reflection right for the camera. There's actual hair hanging. Can you see? That's disgusting. People have said there's been bugs in the bed and everything. So this is the little sink. Yeah, that we brought this in, by the way. This hasn't been left. Actually, I don't want from the vending machine. <laughs> I think it's probably out of date. Look at the plug hole. This wasn't even advertised as a hostel. This is advertised as a hotel. Oh look, a lovely stain there. You see how you use a blade? Look, no. You've got a screw in there. You've got any curtains? Right. You just pull the blade down. Oh look at the stain. Look at that fucking look. It's just a screw. Look at the stain of it. Fucking hell. This is the This is the telly. So 21st century. I don't even want to turn it on. <laughs> this is your little chair. So we're going to expect the bathrooms. I've also found this on the floor, which not going to lie, literally looks like cum. Right. Doesn't look good. We've got marks all over the floor. Like, as you can see here, it's just full of marks. So the bed looks all right presented at first. Like, you've got your um, towels on it. Your bunk beds up here. Can see your bunk. That not that bad. No, I had I think seen. There may be bed bugs. Is it a bed bug? Or are they just smart? No, How do you know? It's just moved. How do you think I know? Oh look, hairs, pubes, <gasps> actual pubes. Look. Oh my god. How do you get bed bed bugs? Like? They just people travel, and carry them. They're definitely there. Yeah, there's like little bugs. Because they're really small as well. Like, you think there's only two, there's not like you can't see the other ones. People have woke up with rashes and that. Yeah, and there's actual like pubes and little bugs. Maybe if you woke up with rash, you'd do well. Yeah, if you've woke up. Hotel, yeah. Look at the bed, look at the bed. The headdress. Bit of wood. <laughs> this is the top bunk. I mean, Honest opinion, 20 quid a night, what do you think? Because when I told Gran, Gran went, well, you can't expect much for 20 quid a night. And honestly, like, you can't, but the least you can expect, in my opinion, is cleanliness. Yeah, the cleanliness. And, like, yeah. there's literally hair hanging from that yeah, hanger. Stain on the floor. Then. Stains on the floor. Like, I think... This is a lot more stained than the quid. Yeah. Like, hey, look, is that a dead bug? Oh, no, it's fluff. Yeah, they just. But it makes, when you say that, it makes you think that's not being cleaned. I don't think that'll have been washed. It doesn't look like a towel. Like, this is the room, honestly. We haven't even seen the fucking toilets yet. Have a We're gonna have a look at them. We can't both go together. <laughs> that looks a bit weird, doesn't it? But yeah, lift But it also depends what you'll never know what the other guests are like, are they? Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh my god. god. Now that is disgusting. I've nearly vomited. Look at the mattress. I should have brought gloves. 
This is actually disgusting. That's, no, that's terrible. I don't care how much it is, and that's unacceptable. <laughs> Dad's get, Dad's livid. Let's go leave this. That's actually. I'm back. That's vile.
Ugh. What the fuck? <laughs> Look at your little heater. Oh. <laughs> Ew, that flame's diabolical, isn't it? That's terrible. It's <laughs> done a window test and the window fully opens as well. Which it shouldn't do. No. It fucking needs to though, it's bloody boiling. I'm not believing it's, that you're Dad loves that here. It's literally like a prison cell. I'm gonna take some food. You've just found. What did you say it was? Pissed over there. Oh, just been, I don't know if you can see, but there's like a yellow stain on the cushion if I was just putting it back. <sighs> They're definitely bugs like, aren't they? Towels, man. You know a chance To be fair though, they don't look dirty. Uh -huh. They don't smell like they've just come out of the wash either, like, but they don't look dirty. Smell it? No. Smell, they've not been washed. <laughs> yeah, so this is basically the overview of the worst rated hotel room in Newcastle. Not gonna lie, I can see where the reviews have come from. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> At least the bin's emptied. Yeah, you get a new bin. You can't think, can't you? So you'd need it if you're staying somewhere like this, wouldn't you? You could not think to that, you couldn't. Nah, you'd need sedation fucking tablets. But yeah, this is it. So, I'm gonna open this a sec because I'm absolutely violent. So, this was the worst rated hotel in Newcastle. Now, me and Dad have come to the decision that we're not gonna stay in it. We have come here, we've reviewed it, and we honestly said if it was decent enough, we would have stayed. Yeah, happily have stayed, but there's no food, there's nothing else really to review. Um, I don't wanna be sharing my toilet, I'm sorry, but if I wanna shit, I wanna shit in peace, not with other people, okay? <laughs> what are you crazy? If I wanna shit, I wanna shit in peace. Well, I do. <laughs> So yeah, I'm sorry, but I'm not going to be staying here and I'm not going to make Dad die of a disease for a video, so that's it. You know, he's old. He's got a weak immune system. <laughs> we'll have to take consideration. <laughs> um, so me and Dad are actually going to go to the Toby Carvery pub and have a nice meal now. But this is the worst rated. Um, we're telling you, Castle. I really hope that you've enjoyed this video. If you would like us to do any more worst rated places, then let us know. Let us know what type of place you want us to do. Put it in the comments below. And yeah, that's the end of this video. I really hope that you've enjoyed it. If you've got any other video suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. And without further ado, tat tat, I will let you go. And I'll see you very shortly for another video. Bye. Bye.